the trauma program manager with the UVA trauma program. She's sitting down with Casey. All right, thank you so much, Steve. Thank you so much for taking the time to be here today. Yeah, absolutely, I'm glad to be here. We are happy to have you. And we're talking about um, UVA. It's designated as a level one trauma center. That's the highest level center that you can get uh, both by the American College of Surgeons and the Commonwealth of Virginia. Yes. What would you say it means to be a level one trauma center? That just means that we've gone through a pretty rigorous process that looks at the services that we offer and um, the the type of um, programs that that we have there um, that really allow for 24 seven access to specialty medical care, nursing care. And that could be anywhere from the emergency department up to the trauma surgeons, neurosurgeons, orthopedic surgeons. Um, it really takes a, a very specialized team that that really look um, very closely at injured patients. Yeah. It is um, a, a, a designation that, um, you know, certainly for us, a level one trauma center actually um, covers a 10,000 square foot or square mile area. Wow. So we have a really large coverage area. Now, hospitals that are not accredited as a, as a trauma center or have a lower designation, they will still stabilize patients and then transfer them over to us. So it's very important for us to have good relationships with our referring hospitals, with our EMS providers, whether those patients come by ground or by air. Um, and so we do provide them education and resources so that we have good continuity of care throughout the whole spectrum. Yeah. So it, it can be quite specialized. And then patients come to the trauma center, not just injured, but they have a lot of other things that might be wrong with them, other medical problems. And so having other specialists there, cardiologists, uh, nephrologists, all of that is very helpful when you're taking care holistically of that patient. Right, and it's something we're so fortunate to have right here in our community, it's amazing. Mm -hmm. What would you say are the different types of injuries you see? I'm sure it's everything, really. We, we actually see, we admitted last year over 1,800 patients. Many patients can get treated and then get help on an outpatient basis, um, or hopefully you know, their, their care is done after the emergency department. But we certainly see the vast majority of patients are actually ground level and usually in our older populations, about 50% of what actually comes to us. We, of course, see the things like motor vehicle accidents um, and just those types of injuries. And unfortunately, the world that we live in, we see an increased amount of gun violence um, that certainly occurs even in our community. Right, it's a difficult thing. What are some of the other things that UVA Trauma Center provides to the community when it comes to providing care and support to people? Well, I mean, it's not just the care of the injured as far as the surgical capacity but it's also the mental components of that. Um, trauma in its name is traumatic, right? And all of us can certainly relate to the time that we might have been in an accident or got that call about a loved one in the accident. And so, again, it's really providing all of that. Um, and then going into the community, and the big part of that is prevention. So we actually have a number of programs and a number of different community partnerships with local schools, government, uh, businesses, and we um, establish programs and support programs in prevention, safety, um, uh, uh, securing devices, seat belts, car seats, um, really emphasizing that drugs and alcohol don't mix in, um, in motor vehicles or really anything that's sort of recreational. We see a lot of that go together. Um, the other thing is really supporting patients in the environment. So we actually have trauma survivors that, that come into the inpatient and talk with the families and the injured um, once and then after they leave we actually have a trauma survivors network that actually helps kind of connect some of these resources and, and be peer support for one another. Yeah, it's amazing what you all are doing. Such important work and thanks for taking the time to be here and tell Absolutely. us about it. Absolutely. Thank you so much for having me. Yes, we'll have you back again soon. Absolutely. Yeah. And Steve, back over to you. All right.